I am Kumar Rani from Government High School, Jawahar Nagar. Near you, sir. Shall I speak in Telugu or English? Yeah, I'm just now you mentioned. People will understand. Yeah, right. Uh, good evening, everybody. Uh, our uh, constitution guarantees equalization of oppor opportunities, irrespective of uh, gender, other sex, or caste and creed and religion. So my question is, why there is a disparity in syllabi, like uh, different boards? CBSE books, ICSE books, and SSE books. Uh, because uh, I expect, as a teacher and uh, on behalf of students, there should be a common book, a single book for each subject throughout India. So why the, such a disparity? Uh, because uh, the, most of the SSE students, uh, they feel that uh, the students who are uh, reading or in that syllabus, like ICSE and CBSE, and generally, they have uh, that application part, that domain uh, uh, development will be more when we compare with SSC students. Uh, and also that analytic and synthetic abilities in uh, cognitive domain, the highest qualities will be seen in those students. Uh, in SSC syllabi, uh, though the teachers, we, we are uh, justifying, uh, we are working a lot to, uh, what do you call it, to mold them. Uh, but still, because the evaluation system is not changed and the books, okay, not the, I'm not talking about the recent books, the older books. Um, mostly they are mugging up. So the memorization, we are encouraging. Though we are explaining, clarifying the concept through a different variety, variety of activities, uh, as you mentioned, which promote scientific temper. But still it is going a waste. So what should we do? We are working hard in the schools. Though we are government teachers, Though we are government teachers, we are working a lot in the institutions. We are for the children, we are not caring our children. But still it is going west. So what should we do? So is it not possible to bring us a common book so that a sort of inferiority complex will be removed from the students also. They can face any type of competitive exams in future. I think you have made your point. There will you want and uh, I have another question also. Um, science, science develop, development of science, uh, it stands on two pillars. One is curiosity and constant interrogation should go together. So here, the children are curious, teacher is curious, but that administration of the school does not allow us for constant interrogation. What should we do? Thank you. Who is answering my two questions? <laughs> For the information of the house and uh, attention of the house for interaction. Recently, we heard about the different types of engineering college in the state. There is no common standard for all engineering colleges. Depending on the facilities, the government of Andhra Pradesh is going to charge the fees A grade, B grade, C grade, D grade. It means you are not giving each equal opportunity, equal standard for the your own student, own for getting a uh, B.Tech degree uh, or uh, uh, whatever the degree you are giving. So you are instead of raising the standards, you are fixing the fees according to the facilities available. How far it is justifiable? That is a, a final decision going to be taken by the state government today and tomorrow. Almost it is over in the cabinet. We have A grade, B grade, C grade, D grade. There is no uniformity in the standards of the engineering colleges. Fees are different grades. What is the analogy for this? You should have a common standard for your graduates. How you can produce A grade, B grade, C grade, D grade engineers? This is for the interaction, please. Yes, yes. So with regard to this school syllabus, ICSE syllabus is different and the CBSE syllabus and the state boards are different. But now what happened, but one thing philosophically if you talk about these syllabuses, it doesn't make much sense also what syllabus, but how you teach and what sort of abilities you want to develop among the children in mathematics or in science, depending upon the nature of science is quite different, isn't it? So but syllabus doesn't make much different, much sense also. But however, uh, keeping in view of national eligibility test, the government of Andhra Pradesh took a decision 
to have the mathematics and the science syllabus equivalent to that of CBSC now. So the same, now 8th and 9th also now they have the same fellows of NCRT 11, okay. This is one thing. And uh, with regard to uh, preparing children for competitive examination, see the, uh, now the school syllabus, uh, school preparation is not for competitive examination, isn't it? The teachers should not have this in, in their uh, 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 brain, okay. This is the, actually we develop the children, isn't it, uh, uh, in all aspects. Isn't it? Develop them how to actually think, uh, how to create, how to create knowledge. All these are the certain things. Okay. And the education is the subject of the center and the state. Isn't it? Both are responsible for to develop or to keep the standards. So every state also have very eminence. Now suppose you take the CBSC syllabus. They are developed in 2005. Now Andhra Pradesh now revised the syllabus in 2010. There is no meaning to adapt a syllabus which developed in 2005. So much changes in this. Uh, also. So, but in case of social studies and language, the service is quite different and which reflects the context of the children. Isn't it? So, it doesn't make, uh, have some sort of very broader ideas teachers, teacher preparing and actually uh, uh, referring the things and going to internet and prove yourself as a, a real <laughs> teacher, real professional. Unfortunately, what is happening is that the teachers now, now lost the habit of reading now. Isn't it? No more we can say that we are really with a professional. And we have main profession. Now majority of the teachers, the, the, profession, the main thing is something other than the teachers. Now. So when uh, Kotari Commission says and linked uh, a national development to the science education or the education, but it only fulfills when you have a proper uh, a professional, proper teachers, teacher professionals. So teacher preparation and a really lot of reading and have some sort of passion that really makes a matter which really actually uh, develops the uh, citizens uh, and actually leads to the national level. Thank you.